What's good, YouTube? It's Constant. I'm back with another MBG 2K21 My Team video. Today, I'm gonna be showing you guys how to score every single play in these Hall of Fame Spotlight Challenges. Now, right here, you guys can see in the Spotlight Challenges. I did this Nate Robinson one, and I'm gonna drop a gameplay. I'm getting these two done, and these Hall of Fame games right here are what you guys are, you know, struggling the most with. Five minute quarters on Hall of Fame against a pretty solid team, man. Like, come on, LeBron. Paul George, Wade, Kyrie, and Melo, like, they don't even have a center. They run some crazy offenses, so, obviously, the games are going to be pretty tough. You guys look over here. What, what team they got? Anthony Davis, Durant, Kawhi, Harden, and Curry. Like, come on. But anyways, let's get to the lineup. I'm going to show you guys how I do this. So, first thing you're going to need is, in your franchise, look, your playbook has to be the Silver Pelicans playbook. Now, it's the one from the regular season, not, like, any old-time playbook or like that. The Silver Pelicans playbook from this current season get this that is a play in it called high five i'll show you guys when we get into the game but make sure you have you know a solid team you guys can't go up against like a god squad with a trash team and you're not like a super elite player and i'm telling you this method it might help but you might realize that they can score every play on you if you don't have enough you know defense so keep that in mind you still might not outscore the defense because you're going to be scoring twos if they hit some threes man you're going to be tight but anyways let's look into this man i have a dunking point guard i have a point guard that can dunk if he can't dunk then the play isn't going to be as effective ran through him we're going to get straight into it so i'll see y'all then all right guys i'm in the game and one thing i forgot to mention is that you're probably going to have to use 10 players from a certain team if you're doing these spotlight challenges so besides that i would say pick a good center for one of those three plays that you get to choose pick a strong forward that can shoot and dunk small forward or shooting guard or wherever you know you decide to put them and pick a good point guard and i'm going to show you guys how to set up this offense so first thing you want to do offensive settings and you want to change your freelance to hawks 2018 just so you can have a better spacing right here this is going to help a lot now especially right here it says best if you have an aggressive scoring pg so yeah keep that in mind and another thing we're going to go to coach settings we're going to turn this off make sure that's off coach sliders help defense zero man this is gonna help when you know if someone blows by you no one's gonna help off the guy in the corner and give the other team a free three-pointer so that's gonna help a lot and besides that you know you guys can toy around with defensive settings but i'm gonna go into my playbook now right now this fourth play i used to take the fourth play pass and screen away because it's the same button as you know the button to call up the playbook so all I have to do is double tap the left trigger. The play is called high five. Now I'm going to scroll down. This is it right here. Now I'm going to select it and simply that's it. Now I'm going to go B right back. Now first thing I'm going to do is call in my freelance. Now you do that by pressing right on the D-pad, left bumper and A, Hawks 2018. And now let me score because I'm running out of time real quick. Shot clock is fading and man, I got swatted. See, that's the type of stuff that happens on the Hall of Fame. That's why I'm gonna help you guys score a lot easier. Now that I have a full shot clock, I'm gonna call this play. Now my point guard's gonna come right here. I'm gonna give the ball to my center and my point guard's gonna get an easy cut to the rim. Easiest play in the game. He had a little trouble finding his way around that time, but come on guys, like this is gonna take zero effort at all. Just make sure you get your stops. That's why you want a good center. And when you have the fast break, man, you're gonna be scoring a lot easier. Like step back, I'll knock that down. This play is gonna help you build your offense. It's gonna be the backbone to your offense. Whenever you realize, hey, it's been like two plays since I scored, the computer is starting to catch up, run the play, run the play. When all fails, run the play, back to back to back if you got to, man. You can run the play all game and only score off this play. It's also going to be good if you want to get a lot of points with a single point guard. I would say evolve someone, man. Cop a point guard, evolve. Look at that. Easy. Easy, man. That's going to be it for this video. Actually, hold up. Let me not end it right away. I want to show you guys another option now. If you guys do not want to run the play through your point guard, man, I really almost ended the video, man. I got some more minutes in. I'm going to try to select it on Dwayne Wade. So now Dwayne Wade is going to be the guy running this play. So if you do want to get your points up with a select player, you can do this. I would say, you know, the player has to be a one through four. I don't know if you can do it with your center. I mean, you probably can. I haven't experimented with that, but that's for you guys to do. 
I'm just glad, you know, this play works and I can score in every play because if you didn't know, there was a similar play like this that got patched. But anyways, I'm going to call the play. High five. I want to call it through Dwayne Wade, though, and I guess it seems like I can't do that. Oh, no, Dwayne Wade will be here. All right, that's interesting. All right, so the play is always going to be run through the point guard. You guys can see right there, they actually played pretty good defense, but it's 8-0 to zero against the Hall of Fame computer. Now, honestly, if I hadn't been using this play, I can't say that it would be 8-0 to zero, unless I had a really good start, but definitely I can always go 8-0 to zero using this. But anyways, that's going to be it for this video. Just to clarify one more time, offensive settings, play selection. Make sure you press X to remove the play square if you're on PS4. Select it, scroll down, high five, and make sure you select the play. And that's it. Have the Hawks 2018 freelance, and that's going to help. I told you guys with the coaching sliders, lower your help defense. This is going to help on the defensive side of things. I know I told you guys how to score on every play, but this is going to stop them from scoring on every play. So if you still can't win because you got bad defense, that's going to help a lot. And yeah, man, that's going to be it for this video. If this helped you out, don't forget to comment and leave a like. Subscribe if you want to see more tips and tricks. That's going to be it for this video. This is the better me, love, but you cannot relate. No, I get some bread on me, no, it's a friend of me waving this shit.